All right, back again. I figured I'd make this quick little uh, video. Here's my phone. Rubber band to the rear wheel. And what I'm checking for is this movement right here. When my wheelie bar in this thing launches the camber. Now, what I believe is happening is, go to accelerate, and it's dropping down a little bit, and as you see, the tire's not flat. Right there, the tire's straight. Right there, tire's way inside. On the other side, it's not as bad. There's no air in between that tire. So actually, the right side has got more camber than the left side. I do understand that it is towed in on both sides. We're working on that. Right now, I'm working on this tire patch because my wear is only from here to about here. My other tire, as you see, is doing pretty good, but still not to the inside edge. So that's letting me know that, hey, when this tire's growing, my camber's off. So Tony, CCXRC, he didn't understand what I mean by, uh, or meant by my phone alignment. This is called bubble level. And it's got several different things that I use. Oh my God, all these ads. So this tells me if I'm straight, which really doesn't matter right now. But right now I'm using this for the degrees down here. So take a look when I, when I move this travel. So just sitting, I'm three degrees in. When I'm down, 3.6 after my burnout I'm 2.6 so I need to get this as close to zero you so figure that's what I mean by using your phone to set alignment so I'm gonna leave this hooked up rubber band to the tire they would do with a car when they put those devices on all your wheels and I'm gonna turn this turnbuckle until my reading right there is like 0 0.03 is what I'm looking for. Or point, I'm sorry, point 0.2. Point 0.2 or point 0.3. That's what I'm looking for. So, that's what I meant by, uh, by using your phone as an alignment tool. I can also set toe with it. And I'll show you that real quick. Let me take that off just so I can make this video. What I do is I go to this, this screen here. So it says we're gonna move. You see that green dot in the center? Hopefully it's picking it up. That I'm gonna pick a point and then I'm gonna measure Draw a string and pick a point. Watch this. So if I wanna check alignment, this is what I do. I'll take the string, I will literally pick a point on a tread line in the center of the tire, and I'll hit plus. Now I'm doing the front of the tire. I'm going to move it to the other side, to the center of the tire, pick the same tread mark. Right there. And it gives you a reading at the top. And the reading says 8.9. Now what I'll do, since that string, if you look, is still drawn. It's drawn across. I'm going to pick a point back of the tire. Pick that point. going to mark it. Take the string. Draw it over there. And mark it. I'm not being real accurate. You need to make it accurate. Pick a line on the tire. 
or pick the outside of the tire or the inside of the tire. And that gave me 9.4. So 8, 8, 9.4, you subtract it, that's your toe in. That's what I mean by doing an alignment. So and as you see on the screen, I've got both lines drawn that I can take a look at and how I drew them. So that's what I mean as you see that back line's way off. But it gives you a visual picking your points and where you're at. So that's how I set my toe to get it real accurate. So Tony, that one was for you. I made it real simple. We'll see you guys on my next video.